Hi there, and welcome to the Pure Proposals channel. My name is Ben, and I'm going to be taking you through how to change the design theme settings within Pandadoc today. So starting here in the dashboard, basically we can jump into any template. On the left-hand side here is the templates. I'm just going to jump into this particular base template. You can see this is one of Pandadoc's sort of pre-existing templates and it has already applied the text and headings and whatnot. So to change the design settings on the right hand side here, you have the option to select design. You can go ahead and change the things like the theme color, headings, etc., from within this section here. So to show you how this works, basically jump into heading and we'll jump into a different font. And you can see that that font populates throughout the, the document in the various sections. And you can, of course, change the color and that will also populate throughout the document. So this is particularly useful if you have a bunch of different documents that you'd like to change all at once. You can use this theme on other documents and templates. And there are a number of options in here that can be quite useful. Things like amending the pricing table section so that when you pull in a pricing table, it has the same look and feel across all of your documents. You can do the same thing with tables as well. So making them very sort of standardized by amending the settings within the design template will then populate across all of the elements you create. There are some things to note, like when you create a page background within the design theme, it's particularly handy because if you have a background color that you apply, for example, let's say we apply a blue, that will apply to all the pages that are sort of standard pages here, for example, by adding a blank page, every blank page will be colored with that particular background color. And you can do things like amend the opacity of that particular background. And you can see how that might be applied here as a styling element. So there we go. That was an overview of the design element. If you have any questions, please drop them in the comments or otherwise shoot me a message and yeah, be happy to answer them. Thanks.